Do you play Molina in Mortal Kombat 1? Well, here are the best cameos that you need to be using. Take it one step at a time. Subscribe here for more Mortal Kombat content and let's go ahead and jump into these cameos. My first choice when playing Melina is going to be Scorpion as a cameo for multiple reasons. Melina really excels in getting your opponent in the air, including with her teleports. We have her ball roll to get your opponent in the air. And out of all these options, Scorpion can extend those air combos, of course, with his fire breath, kind of like this. It's just easy ways to keep your opponent in the air longer, allowing you to do more teleports, more ball rolls, more combos, and of course, more damage. Plus, Scorpion gives you an awesome overhead, and Melina, though she's got good mix-up game, I really like to keep my opponent off guard by going for the lows and then the overhead they might not expect. So for an example, with Melina, we have 4-2-4, four, four, that's a low. I like to follow that up with Scorpion's overhead. So it's a low overhead mix that your opponent doesn't really expect when playing Melina, and you can combo extend off of that as well. Plus, if you play it out right, you can use Scorpion's full screen reset, the armored back pull here to put you at full screen that allows you to either teleport or throw the rolling ball out. Quick and fast moves that your opponent might not expect, thus catching them off guard, giving you a combo. Melina just really benefits off of all the tools that Cameo Scorpion offers, and I love using it. Believe it or not, I actually love using Striker with Melina. For the same reason as Scorpion, in a way, we get awesome low overhead mix ups that really just catch our opponent off guard, not expecting them. So, again, we can do 4 2 4 up Cameo for Striker to the overhead, a good low overhead mix up that, again, your opponent's not really gonna be expecting a lot, or vice versa, go for the low again. Your opponent might go to block the high and then they get hit with another low. It's just quick and easy damage. It really helps out Molina's mix up game. Plus, I love using Striker's cuff move like this. And the reason why that restands our opponent, thus negating their chance to do a wake up attack on us and giving us the mix up pressure back. Keep on mixing up. Plus, who doesn't want more combo extension with the grenades? Kind of like Scorpion, Melina just really benefits off of all the tools that Striker offers as a cameo. And I think he makes a great choice. I love using Serena with Melina because first it rhymes, hilarious. But of course we get the awesome combo extension. But the biggest thing you'll see is with Melina's enhanced back teleport here, we are stuck in an animation, so is our opponent. And that's a great opportunity to use Serena's standard cameo move and just deplete your opponent's meter. They can't move this entire time. You are destroying your opponent's meter during an animation that they can't even move off of because Melina's got awesome combo game. She's got awesome mix-up game and just many ways to keep your opponent in one spot. That one spot should be Serena's kind of major depletion circle. And then not only that, but Melina does have projectile sure our back forward one, but you see there, they're not even full screen. We have to enhance it to get him full screen and that's cool and all, but I want a good solid projectile and Serena offers that with forward cameo. Just a nice, quick, full screen projectile that without using Mina, Melina does not have. I think Serena is probably one of my favorites to use with Melina for that reason alone, but Serena is just an overall awesome choice to use with Melina. These are just my cameo recommendations for Melina. And guys, let me know down below who do you pair up with Melina and why. Subscribe here for more Mortal Kombat content and take it one step at a time.